Okay, this is a quick and dirty guide on how I normally um, import new weapons to XCOM 2. Um, well, we're placing the meshes anyway. Uh, what you need to do is open your SDK as I have here. Um, and for this example, we will use the sword. You can see I already uh, created uh, the SDK where I want the new one to uh, to be in. So I will use the conventional sword. I will find a skeletal mesh. You can see that's that one. Right click it. I create a copy to move it over to the to the new one. And we will just change sword meshes as in yeah. That's all okay. So we're more or less done in this one for now. Um, go into this one. Ignore this one. It's just because I didn't clean up before I started recording. Sorry. Okay. Right click this and export to file. Save it wherever you want to. I already have uh, exported it and it's here. Okay, I opened it twice by mistake. And that one goes, yes. So you can see the sword is here. And for this example, we want the Warhammer 40k, uh, what's it called, chain sword to replace this sword. So we will go in, find the mesh we want to replace it with, import FBX. Uh, let's see, where do we have it here? Okay. Uh, we don't need the skeleton for this one, so what we will do first is clear the parent, but keep the transformation. And uh, delete the old one. Okay. Now we have to adjust it. Um, the size has to be well, somewhat the same, but it doesn't have to be one hundred percent. So uh, what we will do first. As well, so um, then rotate it for now. Let's see, this looks about right. Let's move it into position. Like I said, this is a quick and dirty, it uh, won't be super precise, but nearly Let's see a bit bigger uh, that's about right isn't it uh, let's see just slightly that's it There we go. Um, and what we want, we want to call this as M chain sort C. Let's see, it doesn't remove that. And parent it, sorry. Set parent to object key transform. Uh, that should actually be it. Let's see, export it. Uh, 
Um, Explorer's Chainsaw, Selected Objects, Geometric, uh, Apply Modifiers, Tangent Space, Amateurs, Remove Lead Bones, Export. Okay. And now what we will do, because if we just pull this in, um, again, that, there might be better ways of doing it, but the, at least this is how I know how to do it. Uh, if I just pull it in like this, it will say static mesh, and well, we can't use that. So what we will do is we will right click on this and choose reimport and find the chain sort and open. Okay. And as you can see, we now have the chain sort, but the textures are all wrong. But I'm not going to go into how to apply textures. Ah, oh, you know what? We might as well um, go back to sort. It's just going to be done really, really quick. Uh, let's see. Um, bum, bum, bum. Use that one. Create a copy. Change sort materials. Map change sort. Let's see, we should have the textures in here too. Uh, so, yeah, as you can see, the textures are now, or the material is now in here as, as we want it. Uh, I haven't looked at the texture files to be honest, so, yeah, I don't know which is which. Um, let's see, pull them all in. Okay, let's do a save. Uh, change sort. Uh, that's the normal. Okay. Um, this is. Textures. Sorry again, this is just uh, for my own benefit because I did not prepare the textures before. Um, let's see, and um, I am guessing. This is the mask. Well, we'll try. Okay. We have it here. Materials, meshes, uh, and these three. Pop it in. This okay. textures and the DIF file is texture group cinematic. Okay, the mask file is texture group weapon uh, SPEC, and the normal is. Weapon normal and in here normal BC5. Okay, now we have the textures in. Let's go into the materials, and um, as you can see here, it points to the original textures. So we would just replace the original textures like this. Go into meshes, as I'm, you can see here, that's the material. So we will go in here and we will do like that. Yeah. It doesn't look uh, perfect, but the texture hasn't been optimized for 
to use in here. We might be able to fix that. If you want to uh, mess around with just the one, you can always select the mesh and click that one. And you can see here the changes you use. And you can see it's a lot better now. But we will modify this to 0.5, 0.5, 0.5. This is just the default settings I always use. Uh, and as you can see, we now have a chain sort in game. Well, not in game, but uh, this is basically how you import new textures to replace other textures with. Um, so, yeah. When you're done and you have everything, just save this. Click yes. Wait for it. It takes some time to compress uh, the textures, but it should not take that long. It depends on how big the textures are. Uh, but as you can see now, the normal sort has been replaced with this one. Um, how to do an actual uh, weapon setup will be in another video. Okay, like I said, quick and dirty. Uh, if you have any questions or something, leave it in the comment below. Please don't forget to leave a like if this helped you in any way. Okay, till next time. Thank you.